Hey, what's up folks? This week we're 3D printing a solder dispenser, this time with a crank. We think this is a fun way to store your solder and actually really fun. I mean, who doesn't like to use a crank? We designed this kit as a free download. Links are in the description. The head was dual extruded for printing the eyes and mouth in a different color. But we also have a single color version. You'll just need to print the pieces separately. The crank is a single part that features a print in place hinge with a free spinning handle. It's actually the same part from our USB HID project. The cover snap fits on top and can easily come off. It uses the gyroid infill, so it has this neat pattern that makes it a bit stretchy. This lets you see through the top, so you can check on the solder. The solder wire is press fitted onto this holder and it rotates freely so you can give it a nice spin. The holder fits inside the enclosure and pops into this socket just behind the ear. It can fit your standard solder spool, but you could also resize it to fit something with a different diameter. The antenna is 3D printed separately and just pops into a hole in the ear cup. You can use super glue to stick some of the details like these pupils over the eyes. Just a drop is all you need since these are some pretty small pieces. Another piece is this ear cup that attaches to the side cover. Be sure to check out our learn guide for a full tutorial on this project. Next we can fit the holder into the side cover. Then snap the crank into the drive hub on the end of the spool holder. The cover slides into the enclosure by fitting the grooves through the railing. Then you can press the solder holder into the socket to pop it into place. It's fairly easy to take it apart so you can swap out the solder when it gets low. And there you have it, that's how it works and now you can make your time soldering a bit more fun. This could be a great way to keep your solder wire from getting all tangled up. I find it really satisfying to use, especially if you do a lot of soldering. The crank could also be used for projects that use trim pots or rotary encoders. If you have projects you'd like to share with us, we invite you to come on the show and tell. All participants will receive a free vinyl sticker. Also check out the Adafruit Discord server. There you can join the community, get project help, and share your projects. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for more projects from Adafruit. <laughs>